Hello, let me explain to you what the cloud and cloud computing is, as I have explained to my five-year-old sister. It's really, really simple. Now let's look at an analogy. You want food, you are hungry. You want food. Well, who's going to cook the food? You, and that makes you the chef. Now, but I have other things to do. You know, I have my things to do. He has his, she has hers. We can't always be our own chef, you know, so why don't we have one person be the chef? And we can all go to this, that one person when we need the food. And this is really just a natural progression. Now, let's look at this different angle. I want music. He wants videos, etc. And now, how do I get music? How do I play my music? I need music software. Now, first of all, I need a computer, which has an operating system, hardware, software, warranty, all these different costs. So I'm going to pay $1,000 for a computer just to play music. And if she's going to play, pay $1,000 for a computer that plays just videos, it's not very efficient, you know. So why don't we all rent a, from a giant computer? The giant computer has all this different hardware, software, operating systems, you know, includes the warranty. You know, we don't have to worry about all these uh, upfront costs. We, I, what I want is music. What she wants are the videos. You know, we can just rent these specific services. There's one giant provider who has all these different services. And that lowers our cost dramatically. Now, let's scale back and look at the general problem. We all want digital services. And we, that requires electronic devices, such as a computer, an Xbox 360, and these cost us software, hardware, all these different costs. So why don't we have it all centralized in this one humongous giant computer, giant server, whatever you want to call it, and this is the cloud. This becomes the cloud. Let me draw it. Actually, never mind. So all we have to do is pay the fee for whatever digital services we want. We don't have to pay for this humongous cost that can do all these other different things, but we never get to it because we never needed it. And that is cloud and cloud computing. Extremely simplified. Now, if you dream big, you can be the giant, giant company that provides the servers, that provides the services to the other, to the many, many commu uh, consumers that you know, pay the fees to you. So you can be this and make a lot of money, or you can be, you can stay this, and well, you know, pay less. You know, so that's a win-win for both of us. And that's it. That's cloud computing. And that is the cloud. Explain in such a way that a five-year-old can understand. Enjoy.